I was very emotional this morning because it was so wonderful to be <coughs> together as people in all our diversity uh, this morning. We all know what's in the background. Actually, to be, to be together in this way is a miracle. Just as it is a miracle to be alive, actually. It was wonderful. It is wonderful. Marvelous. This uh, spirit of human oneness is what we call Ubuntu. It's what we are learning about more and more, which is even spreading through the world, and which we want to learn about more today. As a young friend, my understanding of Ubuntu um, is about this community I have, which are the Quakers. Ubuntu in my language means Wunu, which means um, that community which we have and how you handle your community. Here is another person if you could think of me. I would like to tell them that they are coming home, they must feel at home. We are all the same, like it's not like we are from East Africa, we are from uh, Southern Africa or from around the world, we are all the same. Ubuntu to Quakers is more of you are because we are. And this narrates very well. It also uh, uh, communicates very well from the, from, the, the, from the values that we prefer or the values that we adore as Quakers. and it helps us to coexist in the community. Quakers around the world will be coming together to South Africa in August 2024. This will be for our World Plenary Meeting. The theme of this is Ubuntu. from that point on. So we've only got this first session up. Once you've decided... Just being there for other people, giving a helping hand. Ubuntu is a Zulu word, which means I am because you are. We live in community. I exist because you are. So this means respect. It means togetherness. It means equality. <laughs> 